Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, which is brand new, yes. I finally decided to have a go at the YouTube game and try to have fun doing so. I'm going to try to be doing a lot of variety on this channel, but what I really wanted to start with was sharing you my experience with my favorite game, Destiny. I'm obsessed with this game to be honest, and I've been playing it since D1's release. And am I really good at video games? Not really, but, you know, if you'd like to be a part of my journey to become legend, then sit back and relax and watch me fail multiple times while I try to go hunting the Witch Queen. And if you like this video and would like to see some more, then please hit that like and subscribe button. Alright then, eyes up guardians. Now I decided to go with my main for this one, it is my Warlock. I'm very proud of it. And I'm going to be running the void. Alright, so that's enough talking for right now. Let's just get going. Times of crisis, people look to their leaders for answers. But ever since the planets were ripped from our sky, it seems all I can offer are the questions. And now, with Mars return, I hardly know where to start. Was the battering ram from that trailer? Wait, that doesn't look. Oh, it's a cannon. Is it her? Oh shit. I'm so excited. One thing that I love about Destiny is the artwork that they're able to produce with these things. I mean, look at this. That's just beautiful. Three guardians on this side and then the other side we got the hive guardians. I'm gonna be doing the legendary campaign. I know this is gonna be excruciating, but I feel like if I persist enough and push through I can do this eventually. Will I die probably ten thousand times? Absolutely. Also I do apologize. My grandma decided to go on the phone for no reason. And you can hear her in the other room. She does this for a while. And to be honest, I want to hear the soundtrack and I want you guys to experience that. But if she gets too loud or other things keep happening, I might just zero out the sound so you don't have to hear her or anything else around. To be honest, it's not really too loud right now, so what I might end up doing is just, for now, just leaving it the way it is. And if it gets too loud, I'll just probably just take that part out, or I'll just end up just not doing sound for that duration when she starts getting quiet again. I'm not sure, we'll just take it by ear. Um, and yeah, we'll just, just keep going from there. What I wanted to show you really quick is going with for the campaign I'm just gonna use the skull of the dire Ahamkara I'm gonna be running Dynamo 
as well as an empowered finish. Now what I realized when opening the game up is some of the slots expired so I had to quickly go in and kind of look at what some new ones were. So I'm going to go with the Harmonic Siphon and I think I'm going to be comfortable with it. So I'm going to just go ahead and move on. Now the gloves I decided to go with were the Corrupted Echo, Corrupting Echo Gloves. <clears throat> Voice crack. Um, with this build, I kind of want, once again, just focusing on whatever aspects I have for Void, which wasn't a whole lot that I had available at the time, so I kind of just went with the Focusing Strike with some Resilience mod, nothing too crazy. Also, again, with the Empowered Finish, just so it can help me out. I am working on building everything up so I can max them out some progress but now I'm just gonna go ahead and select the campaign this artwork is insane I'm obsessed with this here we go and yes the ship I'm going with is the moth ship because who are we fighting the giant moth So I'm sure that all of you realize that the my camera quality isn't 100% the best. Everything's kind of blurry in and out, so hopefully you are able to read at least some of the things. Um, it's the year of the camera that I have. Is one of the old 2000 little Canons. We're in some kind of crop field. What you see is a window into the golden age. Oh shit. Mars has returned with temporal instabilities, and Salathorn's presence here is no coincidence. We believe the reappearance of Mars drove her out of hiding, and our intel says she may be in a weakened state. The Cabal fleet is blocking the flight path onto her ship. We need you to find a way to get up there and track Salathorn down. This may be our only chance to strike. Well, we are certainly not in Kansas anymore. I mean, hmm. No speeder. That's fine. Alright, so what I wanted to go ahead really quick before I went any further is I wanted to get a look at whatever the new Void subclass is going to look like. And I'm actually kind of surprised that off the bat you're actually given a lot to work with. I thought that we had to unlock all of these things, but you really don't. They give you the majority of them. I kept looking and I saw that maybe there was like three or four that you had to unlock on the other page. Um, they have a lot here, like the Axion Bolts and the scatter grenade which I believe was for solar if I remember correctly I saw aspects I think hmm. interesting I think I'm gonna go with the one everyone was talking about, the Child of the Gods. I'm not sure if that's the best one, but for right now, I'm gonna just probably go with this one. Because I think I'm gonna have some fun with that. Now, Fragments. I did not 
unlock any of the fragments with stasis just because I was trying to focus on doing all the strikes and building reputation so I didn't really do the extra quests after uh, Beyond Light to do all that stuff for stasis so I want to try doing that as much as I can for Void. So I think the Echo of Leeching, I might go with that one actually. Hmm. There's a lot to choose from right off the bat. No, I think... Stop being indecisive, just choose something. You know, I'm just gonna go with the Echo of Leeching. I, yeah, I'm just gonna choose it. And we'll just go from there. And we'll see what these do. Um, I know since I'm not the best at straight up firefights, being surrounded, I'm going to probably need that leech in um, to try to heal me as much as I can. Um, I'm supposed to, oh, there we go. Okay, still can't access the, well, I can't think of words, the, the speeder. So we're going to run to the next spot. Okay, where's the wicked wedge? Where is the Wicked Witch? Damn, her ship is huge. Just getting as close as I can for right now. God, that is just gorgeous. Props to whoever designed the ship. The color, the the almost like gothic architecture, just absolutely stunning. Oh shit. Alright. So they are pretty stubborn, these Cabal. I feel like they might have a little bit higher health. Oh, shit. Maybe, mm, maybe resilience. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Ooh. There we go. God damn it. So, they like to just rapid spawn. What is this? Alright, I can make it. Oh, maybe not. No! Oh! Oh! Run away, run away, run away, run away! Is that all of them? No. All right. Zoom. Setting up, setting up. It's already set up. Head inside and get me to a console. Giving me mad EDZ vibes. 
as it's blue. Cabal are definitely a little bit stronger, I think. They should be, I guess, for the legendary campaign. I think I'm doing okay so far. I haven't died yet. There I go, jinx in my shit. We'll see. Hey, we are inside. Oh. Oh no. Oh, this was a bad idea. Holy shit. That's a good question. Oh boy, here we go. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, incoming fire, incoming fire. Okay, this new aspect is kind of OP. I hope they don't nerf it. <laughs> Honestly, they... Not only can you throw the grenade that, if it's close enough, can still track, but then you take your hand palm, which now also turns into a basically tracking grenade that does even more damage than the regular grenade. Ooh. 
Alright, so the ship gets to fire at you too. Alright. That's death four. Right, where'd they go? This way. Five. You gotta be shitting me. Okay. Now I'm mad, hang on. Oh. His wrench? Oh shit, okay. So we grab the wrench to do this. Alright, so that was the first one. Please. Bitch. No. Shit. Alright, well if the ship could stop shooting at me. Oh. Oh, so he's over there now. Okay, so there's a second one. There's a ship. There's scions. I see that guy. Is, can there be a, yes, okay, there's a back door. Can I go the way, okay. I can use the section I cleared as cover. Okay. Oh, almost. Oop. No! Where did I fall? Oh shit. Okay, well. Try that again. Wait, how did I get lost? Oh shit, no, don't shoot me. Up there? Oh, I'm not gonna last. This thing's too heavy and too slow. Ah. No, 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 no. Oh shit, okay. 
fuck out of here. Hey. Get away. Fuck. Let me process what's happening. All right, so where do I go next? Over here. What? You, it just told me to go this way. Right. In my defense, this is the legendary version. And yes, I'm not the best video game player, but as difficult as this is for me, this might be easier for some of, you know, pretty much everyone else, but I'm having fun still. Gosh. Mm, why did I do that? And I'll put the sword away. So I know. Like, you think, oh, I should focus on killing the smaller ones, but then the bigger ones almost fucking instantly kill you, and then you try to focus on the big ones with the fucking overshields. Well, at least I took him with me. One moment. Alright. Alright, second one put down. There's a lot of ads. Okay. So now we go this way. You know, if I were a god of cunning, I wouldn't show up with a giant ship. It's like saying, here I am, come kill me. Or... Maybe Sabathun's waving a red flag at a bull. Maybe we're the bull. Yo. So, we get our own legendary raid banner. That's cool. That's really cool. I love that design. 
Uh, Destiny just knows what they're doing. I don't think it can rally to this one. No. It's not letting me. Which is, that's fine. We'll just move on. So this looks like the final section. We need two override codes to get the lift moving. Only Cabal engineers carry those. Oh, almost. Okay. This is going to be excruciating. I'm gonna save my super because I don't have I'm not generating enough wharves right now. Times will I die in this room? God damn it. Going for it. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Oh. Hello, sir. You. No. By a scion. Hmm. This again. We need two override codes to get the lift. Okay, let's be smart about this. It's clear. Okay, that one's done. Sneak away. Go hide. Oh, the second I drop, I'm gonna like die. They're all just gonna swarm me. I see you, assholes. Dude. So much for the resilience. God. And I put resi some resilience armors down on all of my gear pieces. Look at this two hits, I'm in the red. Somehow I need to get to the other side and kill that guy. Oh, fuck. No. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Hold on. Alrighty, I killed him. Again, now we're back to where we left off. Everything's loading correctly. So now I just got to bring it. The code that I just acquired over to the center over there. For so I was wrong, you don't bring it to the control panel. Oh shit. Wow, I'm sucking at aiming today. Looks 
looks like he's the only one in there. Oh, shit. Did that kill him? I'm asking really dumb questions right now. Why is it telling me to... here? Hang on. Hey. Oh, down there. Okay. See you. Oh sh There's another one I know. There you are. Oh fuck. No. Can I just take you out by snipe? That'd be nice. I don't think I'm gonna get it. Hmm. And I'm out of snipes. Okay. Idea. Back up, back up. No! I didn't realize how many there were still over there guarding this stupid fucking engineer. Okay. Finally! It's been like two hours, and I have work at three. I firmly believe I'm not going to get this done, the first mission done by the time I have to go to work. So if I could just get to the next section, that would be fine by me. Oh, I have Sniper. Nope. No, no fire. I could just take out Mr. Flame with my sniper. That'd be nice. Oh, he's a yellow. There's two flames. Okay, cool. There's two flame guys. Oh, shit. All 
let's go ahead and make a two-parter. Stupid things and rotators. Is he still there? Mm-hmm. Really? One down, one to go. Oh, he's hiding. He's hiding. Hopefully, whatever's up ahead. <sighs> That's what I was gonna say. Gonna go for it. I could do this. You can do that? Oh shit. Where'd it go? What the fuck? What is that he's doing? He's like pushing me back and shooting the flames at me at the same time? Is that a new thing? Or am I just like completely forgetting that some of them can do that? Ha! Ah. Center. Okay. Oh, so here the whole time, cool. Lift is active. We just have to adjust the trajectory. Oh, yes! Oh, oh. Upgrade modules as rewards. I like that. Double reward. Oh, was I supposed to? Shit, I was supposed to go up, right? Um, I'm just gonna assume to go up. Going up, up. When I was searching for the cannon schematics, I saw marching orders from Kaido. She wants to retake Mars as Cabal territory. Not sure how she'll feel about us interfering. Do I go this way? I do apologize, I kind of now just notice that the camera hasn't really lined up with the subtitles. I'll have to fix that for the next video. What? Right. Hang on. What the fuck? How? Can I shoot that? Is that a thing? No. Oh my god, really? Oh. Oh. Please tell me this is the end of this mission because I really don't want to start this over. Oh wait, are we loading the cannon to get jumped onto her ship? Because if that's what's happening, there's no way I can do that right now. I will have to head to work till 8 o'clock at 3. 
I'm hoping for the latter, but I wouldn't bet on it. We're all hoping it's not gonna be something too crazy. I don't think everything's being done. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, I'm in the cannon now. Oh! Shit! Where am I going? Oh, God. <sighs> and we are on her shit now. Alright, so I'm gonna take this time to hopefully that will save and I'm just gonna head out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm going to be looking to finish this mission as soon as possible, put up the part two, uh, depending on how big the mission is I might have to do a part three just because of just how busy things are right now. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and if you wish to see more, um, just look out for my next video. Um, have a great day and I will see you guys next time.